work, I'ma pull up with my shake, hey, whip on ice, got myself a couple chips, hey, move so fast, I'ma hit you with the stick, I'ma make a couple racks, and you steady hit them like say, no. So we made it to San Diego. The gang's all here. The real reason we're in San Diego is because it's my birthday tomorrow. Here's my birthday picture. Just go say happy birthday to me. That'd mean a lot. We're gonna go to Arizona for Ryan's birthday after. We'll be going out places now. Like we're not just in the apartment. <laughs> I don't know what's gonna happen. I'm a big advocate of the pop socket. I can lay down. You wanna watch a video? Oh, you're driving, you just you're, you're a serial killer if you put your phone down like this. And <laughs> I bought this special one that's like an eight ball. So you shake it, you ask it a question, it gives the answer. Paid like 30 bucks for it. And when I try to shake it, it like doesn't even work. No, anywhere it goes. <laughs> Should we go to the club tonight? Reply hazy, try again. What does that mean? Is Rhino getting laid tonight in San Diego? I don't know. That'll look not so good. See, that's how you notice things broke. Yeah, it's right that shit. That does not work. Will my next video do well on YouTube? Please. The channel's in the dumps right now. Signs point to yes. You know what? I might need to buy one of those. That thing doesn't work anyway, so I'm out of here. We're out of here. Reply, try again. Someone explain this to me. Women and anyone else. So is that like an inclusive thing or? I think they make the signs where it's like everyone, right? Or like all gender. So like just take off the men and women and just say bathroom. They go out their way to rip the cardboard, then write that down. And they could just take the whole sign off. They feel like they want to be inclusive. They put it on there and then men and anyone else. So we're at this ice cream shop. Homemade ice cream since 1945. So that means they were serving this shit in the Jim Crow era. You know they got that Jim Crow flavored ice cream. <laughs> So it's a little racist. Jim Crow ice cream, chocolate only. They'd probably be best for me to order, right? Yeah. What happens if they catch me handing out the cones and shit? I don't see any black employees. <laughs> hey. I know what they're up to in there. Excuse me, is it okay for me to order ice cream here? What? I can order ice cream here? Can you order ice cream? Yeah. Just pulled up to the spot for the weekend. What the fuck is this? Three stories, you said? Yeah. I'm excited. This looks pretty dope. A little turf grass. Private beach down there. I'm about to read a book or something. Let's just hope there's not a tsunami. That would suck. That would really blow. Big ass wave. Ah, uh, shit. I don't know if I could live by the water for my home home. Surely there'd be a fat ass wave that would take everyone out. That's the risk you gotta take, though. Let's see if Noah knows wow. what he's doing. He got that bad camera, though. Keep going. Yeah. Come straight. Come straight. Stop. You can straighten it a little bit if you want to, but you're in here. Corey's back in the vlog. Y'all remember him from that Atlanta trip? Oh. That man busted his ass, bro. I suck at parking so bad. Oh. Breaks the window. We gotta pay for the whole thing. No one can check. I cannot hear that at all. What type of technology is this? <laughs> you off my mind, King. Are they playing the Shawn Mendes in the sunglasses? But where would you wear that? They also have these too. Same song. I think Shawn Mendes has a deal with Best Buy or something. It's playing like on my temples. You're like in class. Oh, I'm not listening to anything. Someone's feeding you the answers. It's playing out of what? Down here? It's crazy because I can barely hear you from that close. This is uncomfortable because it's like in my head, but it's not attached to my ear. This is how you cheat. I don't give a fuck. I did that all in school. Everyone cheats, right? You cheated, right? Uh, a couple times. I'm the best role model. I've actually never I've cheated before. Okay. Well, then you're a loser then. You're lame. Go to Best Buy. Come with $500. <laughs> Take an audio voice recording of you reading answers off to your thing, maybe. And then just have that bitch on repeat. Eyes on your own paper. Oh, yeah, for sure. <laughs> you could cheat in so many different ways now. Now nobody knows anything, so your doctor can be like, to be honest, I don't know what's wrong with you. I got my doctorates and I uh, got all my degrees. Uh, I use the Bose uh, sunglasses. But sir, no, I can't breathe. Next, please. <laughs> best Buy. Who said it was the best, though? Is this a rebrand? Were they better by before? Only problem is you look like a weirdo if you're like jamming to like, it. What is this guy's problem? Like you're sitting there. Do you have to be plugged in? You walk with all these wires. <laughs> when pretty much everything's already been invented, Bose is like, we gotta do something. Sunglasses with speakers in them. I don't know if I'm digging the fat. It's 2021. Give me a sleek. I got TVs thinner than that. I'm a high value man. man. Band. Who's buying this big ass Bluetooth speaker, dude? Bring it to the beach, like, don't worry, I brought the speaker. <laughs> hey, bro, you bring your JBL speaker? Oh, I got you. <laughs> We're gonna be set it up. I pair it. That's some YouTuber shit. Pairing to the speaker in a Best Buy. Waiting for a noise <laughs> Oh, shit, I connected. Let me play something. Um, I got bitches all on my Pulled up the Seder Bros. Cause we're like pros and shit, so. Getting some birthday snacks. 
let's say. Noah's birthday's tomorrow, mine's the next day, and then Rhino's the next. It's crazy it's, how that works. I'm September 16th, you're the 17th. And 18th, and we have a channel together, and we're best friends. I don't know how that turned out so well. That's we're gonna crazy. turn out this weekend, I got. Yeah, I've heard that before. <laughs> Uh, Y'all wouldn't know. I wouldn't know about that. Okay, so like I'm trying to turn up, but I can't really try to get someone's attention that works here. This is what he did. Hey, excuse me, sir. I was wondering if I could. Dude, you heard me. I don't work here. You do. Like, well, that's not my section. Hello. Anyone work here? Birthday is tomorrow. Anyone got the key for the? I guess we sipping on Kool Aid today. Yo, anybody work here? Hello there. You work here, sir? No, I work in all the stores. I don't know nothing about the product. Yeah, all right. Look the product. So the guy had the Stater Brothers shirt on, but he doesn't know nothing about Stater Brothers. And he still tried to ignore me again. I was like, dude, hold up. You that's, work that's, here. You know somebody can have a key for the alcohol? Yeah. Go. We'll go over there. Here we the if anyone lives in San Diego, apply to work at Stater Brothers because they need help here. Really, about two employees, that's all total. I was trying to make some small talk with the checkout lady, and she was just giving me attitude. I'm like, miss, this was the best part of your day, miss. Never. It's because it's Noah's birthday or something. He thinks he can just park any way he wants to. Yeah. The line in the middle. Y'all were in there for about 45 minutes. You want me to tell you why? Yeah. Had literally one worker, dude. I was like, I thought they were just getting one bottle. Yo, what's up guys? It's my birthday today. Hey! hey. Just turned 24 years old. The older I get, I just realize how precious time and life really is. No, you're so young, you're still a baby, blah, blah, blah. I do agree on that 100%, but like, I'm just grateful for what I have and where I am right now. My 20s are all just for fun, so we're just gonna see how it goes. Speaking of fun, I'm gonna be going skydiving today. I don't know why I chose that activity, it's just more of like a bucket list thing. I'm pretty terrified of heights. I'm not going alone. If I'm jumping off the bridge, my friends are jumping off the bridge. I got Miles. We lit. We got Mike. Yes, sir. And we got Corey. I was like nervous a couple days ago and then I just kind of like accepted it. I'm not really scared. I'm just focus. I've been told there's like this euphoric feeling when you're in the air for the free fall. We're jumping out, I think like 20,000 feet and they said that's about 90 seconds free fall and then five to seven minutes on the parachute. I was like, oh, this whole experience is 10 minutes. Right, it's just gonna go by that quick. I'm pretty nervous a little bit, but when we get over there, I think my nerves are gonna calm down a little bit. Listen, man, going up, being in that fucking airplane gonna be nuts. <laughs> I do realize that we all are signing our lives away though. Not for though. Ryan really wanted to do it, but he has a whole gig that he's doing right now. Speaking of which, where's Rob? Yo, Rob. Yo. Oh, sorry. Oh, shit. I was making out with like a hot girl in there. Uh, oh, it's your birthday. It's my birthday. Oh, happy birthday. Oh, dude. fuck. Yeah, I just woke up. Sorry. Shit. Just like cuddling and shit. You going skydiving today? Not going skydiving today because I'm sending like my wishes to you guys because I already went. I want to leave the fun for you guys. Yeah, I know. Uh, okay, I'll go for it. You're cool with that. Yeah. Who do you think is gonna look the most scared in the video footage? I think I will. <laughs> this is where I sign my life away, I guess. Love you, Mom. Love you, Dad. <laughs> Your parents know you're doing this? No. <laughs> Whatever happened to Miles? Oh, he's in San Diego. Like, he's, San he's Diego. like in San Diego. Yeah, okay. Whatever. Any and all other dependents upon me, so that in the event of my death, they will have suffered no financial loss. Um. Ah, fucking signature. Fucked it up. Oh, fuck. I lost everything. I'm trying this again for the second time. I have to put an emergency contact name here. I'm gonna put Ryan, like, I'd rather him be, like, the first to know, like, hey, make sure you continue the channel. You and Rob, like, just do something, because I just want y'all to get the text right away. So, Ryan Burton, let me fill this out real quick. Free jump, gotta cover the hair up. Hey. hey. So, we're about to jump out of a plane. Nah. We're about to jump out of a plane, Mom. Why y'all doing Say hi to YouTube, too. Ask her how she feels, though. Okay, well, my prayers are with you. Okay, y'all will be fine, because y'all are doing it. I'll let you know how it goes if, if I come back down. No, you come back down. I'm the main reason he's doing this. It's my birthday, and I was like, hey, if I'm gonna jump, my friends have to jump. No, uh, uh, <laughs> how many times have you jumped out of a plane? Just three. I imagine he said never. Like, oh, I don't do that. Are you crazy? Who the hell would jump out of a plane? I'm like, what? One of the guys, was, he was watching a YouTube video this morning trying to make sure he remember how to do it. It's a new tactical list, bro. You can get it off um, seeing men. <laughs> I don't think my brain has still processed what we're actually doing. I feel like you're going about it all wrong. Stop thinking, man. Yeah. Just go with the flow. Danger. <laughs> it makes sense danger on our back. Don't read it. Don't read it to me. Any last words to family, friends before we get going? Love y'all, love you. Love y'all. Uh, see you on the other side. Did you notice like there can't be bad reviews for skydiving? Because like right. the people right. that didn't they can't. They can't. Yeah. Yeah.
all unscathed, back in one piece, baby. Whole gang yeah, made it. It was fucking crazy. Right that back, Turbo. Only downside, like my ear pop beyond belief, and I'm still like half dead. That's like the only thing that's bothering me. We all got to sit on a nice little bench. Miles was sitting on the ground, and they were opening the door, just checking the whole time if we're high enough. I'm like, bro. Trying to make me nervous the whole day. The guy's like, bro, like, you need to relax. I've been doing this for six years. I can tell when you're not relaxed. I'm like, bro, my first time. And you put me at the front. Bro, we jump out. We're like halfway down. This guy goes, Miles, do you smoke? I'm like, yeah. He was like, this is a great time for me to tell you I'm high as a fucking kite right now. <laughs> I'm like, get me down. <laughs> I ain't regrets not going. Man, I'm happy I didn't go. I'm on the channel like no one would want us to hit 10 mil subs, so y'all need to sub. Do it for Noah. Follow me on Instagram for Noah. It's been about two hours and Miles still has his skydiving tag. I've been so excited. Can't take it up. No. I just want everybody to know my name. Just to let him know. Let him know yeah, that he's you know, adventurous. Keep your band-aid on all day when you got vaccinated. Let people know. Just got here at our favorite breakfast spot. A little celebration lunch man for my birthday right now. Birthday boy. Have you ever seen Silent Library? Um, Who hasn't? Oh. I need, I need a double, double cheese, cheese burger and hold the lettuce. Don't, don't be friends, sign no seeds on the loan. I'll be up in this drive through order for two. I got a craving for a number nine. Like my shoe, I need some chicken up in here. In this dizzle, for rizzle, my nizzle. Extra salt on a frizzle, Dr. Pepper, my brother. Another for your mother, double, double, super size, and don't forget the fries. Crispy, crispy. crispy. Everyone's looking at us. That's old internet right there. Kids these days don't know what the hell that is. No, they only you know, know kids don't know about the McDonald's James freestyle. James Charles and Charlie D'Amelio. That's about it, yeah, Dixie and shit. <laughs> Dixie D'Amelio was Charlie. Why is stuck on the syrup? Why on the table one more time? Oh, oh shit. You never mind. I wasn't gonna drown the flying syrup. That was just a joke. He liked it. We wanted to give him more syrup. He only was eating the little drips. He, he like, only got like a little size. I was trying to give him even more. Oh. Here's something I've been writing. Ready? Pull up in the hatchback Kia Bluetooth. That's hands free. He think it's time to get nasty in a backseat. But that is what led to the problems like math sheet. Oh, come on. Oh, my God. Come on. Led to the problems like math sheet. He was on to something. Yeah, you were on to something. Pull a big body. I told a bitch on him. Ain't no more fucking problem. Yo, Rob. Rob. Oh, yo, what's up? Uh, we're here at the, the bay or whatever. Here we go, Jesse. First time. This is bigger than I thought it was gonna be. Make sure we stay away. We don't want to crack. I'm in the front too. I have to lead it. I'm like, fuck, I'm getting paid. I just told that bitch to come on over right away. We might go to Pluto, we might go to outer space. I, I, I don't give a fuck about a bitch or what she say, or what she say. When you crashed into someone, I crashed into a boat. <laughs> okay. So when that happened, what did you do? It knocked the engine off. <laughs> My fingers hurt. That was what I needed right there. Here, when good, man, that was great. It was cold. Overall, we had a good time. To the scene that I'm Playing five seconds here. The point of the game is you have five seconds. The game is gonna ask you a question. And you got five seconds to get that bitch right. Name three clothing brands. Go. Off white, Gucci, Louis V. One team on top, man. Let's go. Name three units of measurement. Time. Uh, currency. Water. Uh, 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 water. You can measure water. water. Gram. Pounds. Like, yeah, gram. Oh, pounds. I didn't know. Name three brands of watches. Nixon. Rolex. Richard Milley. Name three things babies do. Buy, eat, sleep. Three words that rhyme with all. Tall. Ball. Mall. Okay, Rob. I got an easy one this round. Pull together for this one. Name three things you can read. Book, newspaper, internet, news, uh, online. consensus, you got it right. We left the restaurant, but I didn't realize that I had the cup still in my hand, so I got a beverage for the show. I guess. 